Liberty defeats Radford 18 to 10 this afternoon. It was back and forth early on, tied at three, but after that, the Flames really controlled the action. Kayla will take a look at some of the highlights from today. Liberty was just relentless on offense. Relentless on offense, relentless in on defense, relentless in the clear, relentless in transition. They just dominated this game um, pretty much in every aspect, in the, every stat category as well. Brooke Bryan led the way with four goals, and we also got to see some some fresh from some freshmen score the quite a bit today. So got to see some new faces on the field scoring goals, and Liberty just really took control of this game after that sort of back and forth there at the beginning. But ever since then, they kind of didn't let off the gas. Saw Brooke Bryan there with. Part of her four goals, Leah Ruby, a hat trick. Olivia Glaze, first three goals of her career. Radford did try to cut it close after Liberty led by as many as 10 on multiple occasions. So Radford staged a little bit of a late surge, but all in all, the Flames in control. Mia Toscano, a son, player of the week last week. That was her second goal of the day. Also worth noting, Tori Banks had the first two goals of her collegiate career. Here are the final numbers from this afternoon. Yeah, you can see that Liberty just dominated in pretty much every category here. Um, you will see that Radford had more saves, but again, look at the shots compared to Radford. Um, their, their goalie had a, had a long day. Yes, yeah, a lot of those saves out of necessity. 34 shots for LU and a dominant victory, their second of the year. Liberty will be on the road for its next four games. They'll be back March 26th. That's when they will host Delaware State. Liberty 2-0 on the fields on East Campus after an 18-10 defeat over the Radford Highlanders.